Toyota is one of the leading automotive giants that has been working tirelessly towards developing hydrogen technology to power our cars. And more than that, they see hydrogen as an energy source that can power our houses and businesses as well. And to prove that this technology is usable for more than just the automotive world, the Japanese automaker has partnered with Fukushima Prefecture to create an eco-friendly production facility that uses hydrogen to power their plants. This month, Toyota plans to put the system into operation at the Denso Fukushima Corporation plant by using technology that it developed for the Mirai and the Sora FC bus. Toyota's generators will use proton exchange membrane cells that the company claims are highly reliable due to the mass production of those in the vehicle. Now, these generators will have built-in electrolyzers and Toyota's generators use titanium stack separators to improve the reliability of the electrolysis equipment, a technique that it learned from the first generation Mirai. The material is used because of its corrosion resistance, which helps keep the generator's performance stable after more than 80,000 hours of operation. Moreover, Toyota claims that its generators' fuel cell stacks will share 90% of the components with that of the company's fuel cell electric vehicles. This allows Toyota to mass produce the parts, reducing costs for both the generators and the vehicles. Now, Toyota plans to use the Fukushima plant as a proof of concept to promote its widespread adoption of the technology. And as we all know, Toyota already has a strong belief in hydrogen as the future of the automotive industry. And this isn't the only cool thing that Toyota is currently busy with. You see, Toyota has recently announced that it has run a race car on liquid hydrogen for the first time ever and plans to compete with it in the 2023 season of the Super Taiku Racing Series. Now, Toyota has competed in endurance races with the hydrogen internal combustion engine Corolla, but that one used highly compressed hydrogen in its gaseous state instead of liquid hydrogen. This will be a first. Why are they trying this new approach? Well, the reason the company is focusing on liquid hydrogen is that liquid hydrogen can double the mileage of a car when used in the place of hydrogen in its gaseous state. This breakthrough will allow for smaller hydrogen refueling stations and Toyota also thinks that liquid hydrogen will be more suitable for passenger vehicles due to its flexibility in terms of shape when it comes to the tanks and its lighter weight compared to the gas tanks. If you would like me to do a full video on this topic, leave a comment and I'll get working on it as soon as possible. Anyways, back to these hydrogen generators. Toyota isn't the only manufacturer looking into using hydrogen for powering their plants. Other automakers are also looking into this technology, with Honda recently announcing that it has put a hydrogen generator into use at its California data center. This emission-free technology replaces the polluting diesel generator that was previously there showcasing Honda's commitment to sustainability and showing us the versatility that this technology could bring. Now before I end of this video, I want to quickly just show you how awesome this technology is. We could literally run everything in our daily life from hydrogen. So let's start with our houses. Toyota is developing systems that can take hydrogen capsules and use these capsules to power our entire house. Where do we get the hydrogen? Well, with tech like the solar panel, researchers from Caillou Leuven in Belgium are creating, you would be able to create 250 liters of hydrogen daily from sunlight using only the power of the sun and water. Then your car, that can run on hydrogen as well. Everything can be incorporated to work on this technology. It's green and as this technology progresses, it will become more affordable and the infrastructure should also advance. But let me know what you think down below. Do you agree with me? Would you like it if everything ran on hydrogen? I think it's pretty cool, especially if we can get stuff like the solar panel running, because then you can make your own hydrogen at home. You would be able to run your house technically for free, because it uses rainwater, the electricity from the sun, electrolyzes, creates the hydrogen. You just have to take the hydrogen then, put it in the capsule, put it in your house, boom, you've got power. Genius. Anyways, let me know down below what you think. If you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you did like it, you like a lot of my other stuff. So just go through it, see if there's something else you like. I'll check you guys in the next one. Cheers, I. Over the edge, feel like I'm floating through the air. 